We can sit up in speeds of 40 kilometers an hour, hold your breath for up to 12 minutes, and we'll be Excuse me, who's this uh, presenter? What's going on out there? Uh, yeah, bad start. Bad start? Yes, he's upset with you. Why is he upset with me? See, you forget something important about being a step up. I don't understand. Oh, very much. Okay, then I'm in trouble. You see, we were supposed to start the show by firstly saying that C9s are very intelligent, and the one up there in particular, very good looking too. How's that? Oh. Hey, Chuck, you know. Yeah. 
Thank you. 
opportunity to remind all of us to take better care of the environment, especially the ocean. Fresh has not only made it ugly, it has made the ocean an extremely dangerous place to live in. Today we will get to know the ocean's deadliest monster a little bit better, I'm not talking about a shark nor a killer whale. We will address plastic waste. Marine animals could easily swallow plastic bags, choke and die. But we know that there are plenty of other dangerous plastic monsters lurking in the ocean and today we're going to get to know two main culprits. First up, fishing lines. These things, they get entwined and entangled around the animal's neck and flippers and could cause great damage, just like a broken flipper. That's awfully painful. Also in recent years, more and more pieces of fishing nets are found in oceans throughout the world. Problem with this is marine animals get caught in them. What happens next, Pedro? They drown and they die. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, cut. An emotional actor, are we? Let's carry on. Oh, okay. It's been all great performances. We give him a big one. And we don't need to go big, we start simple, we reduce, reuse, and recycle. Reduce the amount of trash we make by reusing materials. Pedro has got some really good ideas to share. First up, that bag is hanging on to right now. Alright, it's made of canvas, meaning that it is reusable. More importantly, it would help to save on paper and plastic. We're gonna move on to idea number two, and even for me, this is hard, but let's try to cut down on one time use plastic products. Popular demand. Disposable mineral water bottles, right? Instead, it's in plastic that's hardy and sturdy and could last a longer period of time, just like that bottle he's hanging on to right now. Lastly, we are going to tap on the most famous R. And we are all going to get to have a see just how great Pedro is at recycling. Where's our trash? Ew, disgusting memory. We got you covered today. Okay, we got our trash and we're all going to the nearest recycling center. Come on, we can do this. It is time to win it in. My goodness, we can clean the sea line to do this. We can easily pull the to the shore together. We can put the stuff through the ocean's deadliest monster. Thank you, Ben Girl. Now, on that note, we are nearing the end of the show. But before that, Pedro has got one last one for all of us. So those of you with cameras, you might want to put this on Pedro. Ready when you are. Let's do this thing. Thank you so much for joining us here at Splash 